3, I'm Hayri and I'm here to teach you Korean. Um, today I'm going to teach you um, 5 phrases to use when you meet your bias, um, sometime maybe in your dream, maybe even real life when you're in Korea. So here goes. The first phrase is, 혹시 비스트에 귀가 오빠 아니세요? One more time. 혹시 비스트에 귀가 오빠 아니세요? Which means, maybe you are Beast member Kigwang Oppa. Literally, it means, are you Kigwang Oppa from Beast? One more time, it goes, 혹시 Beast의 Kigwang Oppa 아니세요? The second phrase we're gonna learn today is, 오빠, 너무 멋있어요. 저 완전 팬이에요. Okay, you need to know that you need to add a little bit of ego to that sentence. One more time, it's, 오빠, 완전 멋있어요. 저 완전 팬이에요. Which means, 오빠, you're so cool and I am your really, really big fan. The third one is the important one. 저기, 저 사인 한 장만 해줬으면 안 돼요? 저기, 저 사인 한 장만 해줬으면 안 돼요? Which means, could you give me one autograph, please? And you need to do it really, really cute so that they can actually give you an autograph. The fourth sentence today that we're going to learn is, 사진도 한번 같이 찍어 주시면 안 돼요? One more time. 사진도 한번 같이 찍어 주시면 안 돼요? Which means, could I take a photo with you as well? Remember, you need to sound a little bit cute so they can they, they can actually take a photo with you. One more time. It goes. 저기 사진도 한번 찍어 주시면 안 돼요? Okay. And the last thing that we're gonna learn today is really really cute. So remember to remember this sentence. That's. 오빠, 저랑 결혼해주세요. Which means, 오빠, will you marry me? So that you can actually say yes in your dreams. So, we're going to get Jeremy to help me today to see if these sentences actually work. So let's all welcome Jeremy! Hi Jeremy! Okay, so Jeremy is going to act as Beast Kugang for me today because he's actually my bias in real life. So let's pretend that we've just met him randomly in the streets or something like that, okay? Here goes. Okay, so we've learned the five phrases today. I'll just go over them really quickly for you. The first one is 혹시 비스트의 기광 오빠 아니세요? The second one is 오빠 완전 잘생겼어요. 저 완전 팬이에요. The third one is 혹시 저 사인 한 장만 해주실 수 있으세요? The fourth one goes 사진도 한 장만 같이 찍어주세요. And the fifth one, the most important one is 오빠, 저랑 결혼해주세요. So remember all these five phrases and wait for the next tutorial on Company 93 and we will be with you very, very shortly. Bye! Thank you for watching!